Grab a bag of potatoes. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> what happened? Oh, nothing. They stay covered this still. Are the potatoes okay? These ones didn't fall. No. Those ones did. Are they okay? Oh, yeah, they stay covered. Okay. Welcome back to my channel, Olive Shoots and Ginger Roots. My name is Tabitha and I'm a mom to 10 children. And today we are doing a grocery haul. But first, check out my new table. So pretty. That table has been a labor of love and we finally got all of the chairs put together and set up and we got the base put on. We actually purchased these legs at Amazon, same for the chairs, except for the two on the ends. I had those previously. So I will link them in the description below. They've been great, I love them, and I can't wait to finish the top so that we're able to actually have a meal at it. Say hi. 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 This time I have Olivia and Ethan with me. Hi. And he's putting on his shoes. So we are going to hit a bunch of different stores. We have Trader Joe's, Target, Sam's Club, Costco, Walmart. I also need to stop at Natural Grocers and possibly Sephora. But first, we're going to head to the car wash. Starbucks so and I don't feel guilty this time because it was a shaken espresso with almond milk we are just waiting for the car to get finished so that it's all clean I like to do this so that it's nice and fresh what are you doing? having some issues I feel it's like technical. it looks like a cappuccino you can pretend it's a cappuccino yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so the car is clean. What do you think? I think it's very nice. Oh, yes. <laughs> Super nice. Yeah. Yeah, so clean, right? They clean the inside glass and everything, so. A lot quicker than if we were to do it ourselves. Right? I think it looks good. It is faster, actually. You don't think it's faster? No, I do think it's faster. Um. All right, so now we have to stop at the vacuum store. So we're gonna go into Oric. Oric orc my words orc is it orc oric yeah oric um we need to get vacuum cleaner bags we have a small hand held auric vacuum and we also have the upright so after we hit the vacuum store we're going to go to costco then we're going to head back up to trader joe's and then over to target probably drop all of that stuff off at home then go back out to Sam's and Walmart, drop that stuff back off at home, and then go out to Natural Grocers because that is all the way on the other side of town. You should just get a trailer. What's that? Ooh, what'd you say? Nothing. <laughs> yes, you did. What did you say? Uh, nothing. You said we should just get a trailer. Yeah. Why can't you repeat it?
my goodness. Henry would be in heaven. He sit down. Look, it breaks apart. Her pops. So it comes in three pieces? Huge. I know. I totally want this. Is that a drone? Yep. Oh, baby Yoda. It's videos. Oh, baby Yoda. So normally I get wine at Trader Joe's for like roast and things like that. Really cute bottle. Should we buy it since it's a cute bottle? Yes. A bag of potatoes. <laughs> I thought I didn't want to. You okay? <laughs> what happened? What, what happened? Oh, nothing. Uh, they stay perfectly still. <laughs> Are the potatoes okay? These ones didn't fall. No. no. Those ones did. Are they okay? Oh, yeah, they stay perfect. Okay. Kale. Have we had it before? Well, yes, you didn't like it, so I ate it for you. But you like it? Yes, I love it. What are you doing? Okay, so we have made it through 
Costco. And so now we are going to run into Trader Joe's. Um, I have significantly less to get in here than I did before. And then we will hit Target. Um, that's where I get our vitamins and things like that. So we will be back. to open the back and all the groceries from Sands went flying out we have a couple casualties but not too bad so now we are putting these things in the back seat Cheers. are you cold I love your flowers they're so pretty dropped off one set of groceries and now we are going to go into Hobby Lobby. We're gonna say hi to daddy for a little bit and then we are going to finish the rest of our shopping. Yay! <laughs> Who's a little tired? Me! Me. I'm, I'm not tired. <laughs> oh. Well, I mean, we'll just hang out in the car. You just go do all the grocery shopping then. Actually, that one. Okay. Hi. 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 How was your day? Good. Good. Hey. Hey. How's yours? Really good. Uh, good. How are you? Did you? Where's he at? Over in the audience, and I was like, I don't care if he's home. He's my dad. I don't care. Exactly. Right. I was like, fine. Think I'm weird. I don't care. For telling your dad goodbye. I mean, like well. customers. Oh, no. Be like, what's up? It's my homie. No. Oh. Lead me. Jeez, are we running? Mr. Wonderful. Oh, it's my <laughs> No, I'll stay in video. Oh, oh, oh. Where'd you go, Costco? Uh, let's see, we went Costco, Trader Joe's. What's that? We were going to go to Target, but they're out of the bed. Oh, so okay, yeah. Get. And that's why I ended up getting a bunch of stuff. Well, not a bunch of stuff, but so we some ass up at Trader Joe's. Yeah, so we kind of cut um, Target off the list anyway. So we did take care of three stores. <laughs> Where else you have to go? Natural Grocers, Sam's, and Walmart. Oh. The big ones. <laughs> oh, here, let me get a picture of you. They're the chocolate candies. <gasps> and they're kosher. Hey, these would be good. Are these on sale? Mm -mm, Do they ever go on sale? White and blue. White and blue. White and blue. Perfect. <gasps> and silver. <gasps> and silver. Should we get some? Yes. Aww. Little Christmas miracle. He does it so well, doesn't he? Look at him. Does such a good job. Pulling all the wreaths forward. What would they do without him? <laughs> They'd have wreaths messed up, is what they would have. Do you want me to give you something to edit? <laughs> What's that? Do you want me to give you something to edit what? out? What? I don't want to do it. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I feel like you're stalking us. Alright. I need these. We got some stuff. Hmm, did we ever? <laughs> It wasn't part of the plan, but when you go into Hobby Lobby, you never know what the plan is going to be. Oh my gosh! You never know what's gonna fall. <laughs> Did you drop? 
No. Okay. I did not drop it. My, I hit my knee. Oh, are you okay? Oh, yeah, it did. Oh, the aluminum? Like, yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's got cold oh. stuff. So see. Oh. It was oh. overflowing. Yeah. There's a um, slight. Um, I'll take this because I want to wrap it for you. No, you can't. Oh, well, fine. I can put it in a bag for it's special. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hello. Uh, hello. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. No. I would. I would so do that. No, I'm way. not calm. Oh. You're not what? She's quiet. Oh, there's a video. <laughs> oh, well, we came to go to Sam's Club, but. Turns out they're closed. So I forgot that in our new town, which yes, we've lived here for seven months. Eight months almost. Seven or eight months. They close at eight and ours used to close at nine. So we're going to go to Walmart. I'm going to make a grocery order for Sam's and pick it up in the morning before I take my daughter to work. Sounds like it's so late. So pretty. Oh, hey, hey! She's like, <laughs> you're so pretty too. <laughs> oh, you're so pretty. Thanks. Thanks. It's a baby in Westwood. <laughs> okay. To Walmart. We shall go. Terrifying if my phone like this, you know? Yeah, it is a bit creepy. It looks like it looks like some like someone who was dead because you're. Look how white your skin is with that. No, don't put it on me. I mean, oh, we didn't go to Sephora. Sephora? What's Sephora? Oh, what's Sephora? it's perfume. Oh. No. Oh, oh, I feel, I feel what like. Is oh. Are they closed already? Yeah. Oh, dang, That's... I would have wanted to go there. Yeah. Wait, is it perfume? What is it then? I thought it was perfume. They do have perfume, but we weren't going there for perfume. What were you going there for? We're going to Walmart, and oh, that's going to be it. What were you going to Sephora for? Um, face stuff. Facial peels. Ow. What's that sound? <gasps> Somebody what? put a sticker in my thing. <gasps> Ethan, get out. A sticker from I didn't even see this person. What is it? Uh, daddy's and um, the. Uh, who did that? Oh, that must be the peel from earlier when they did the vehicle. Woo! Walmart's what? Nothing. <laughs> you tune in? Kind of looks a little similar. Oh my gosh, it's the Walmart knockoff of your watch. <laughs> when I get earrings, I mean them from here, not Hobby Lobby. Watch. Grace, what do you think of my tiara? <gasps> I love it. <laughs> it so beautiful. I want to wear a tiara. Why don't you wear it then? Look at the price. Look at the Let me see. I'm not wearing it. Ah. <laughs> or so I just, gorgeous. Mommy, can I get the kind with the gold band or can I get the flat? Oh, I don't know. Not those. Okay. Go back to the others. Turn to the side. I like it. <laughs> I like those too. Which one's better? I mean, if I think of you, I think of these. Yeah, I like those. Can you see okay in them? Yeah, I see oh, fine. It's orange. Ooh. Yes, I can see everybody. All right, guys, the part we've all been waiting for. Costco, I spent a total of $614.33. And at Trader Joe's, I spent a total of $126.88. So let's get into the haul. 
All right, so first up we have some shredded mozzarella cheese. I did see a comment from a friend and they actually call it grated cheese. I believe that was in the UK, so I thought that that was really interesting. But two and a half pounds here of mozzarella cheese. Um, we have some shredded Mexican style or grated, however you prefer to say it. Um, I believe that's two and a half pounds as well. I use that for enchiladas. Then we have Mediterranean Crunch chopped salad. Olivia wanted some sweet kale. You can see Henry down there in the bottom right hand corner. So cute and orange. Then we have Stonyfield uh, Organic Kids yogurt. And I actually put these in the freezer. Then I got two containers of this organic Greek yogurt, two of these big containers of low fat cottage cheese. I'm going to be using that in Amish breakfast casserole. I decided to try the Kirkland's grass fed butter. And then I thought we would try this. I thought it looked really interesting. I thought it might be good for toast. There's that tzatziki sauce from the haul video. And you can see the gyro slices are right next to it. And then here we have these massive containers of half and half and heavy whipping cream. I was in shock when I seen them. And then Emma loves old fashioned eggnog, so I picked that up for her. I did grab the Starbucks hot cocoa. We'll give that a try. The kids weren't crazy about the Mexican hot chocolate that I got last time, so we're gonna try this. We have a bag of yellow sweet corn. Uh, two 18 packs of eggs, Lego my ego. We've got 72 waffles, those are already gone, matter of fact. Here we have organic coffee beans and some dried pineapple, also organic, organic tomato sauce. That's a step up from Sam's. Then we have peaches and a great deal right here with this red pepper and tomato soup, six packs. I mean, that's just a big deal for us. We go through that a lot. And then we have some beef stock, six cartons of that. Chicken stock, six cartons of that as well. We go through quite a bit of chicken and beef stock. And then we have cilantro and lime rice. The kids have really been liking this. I've been trying to create a recipe of our own for it though. And then I did get some table water crackers. And then we have Apple and Eve apple juice for the kids. Mott's Organic Applesauce. If you have noticed a trend, most things at Costco are organic. These tiramisu desserts, I highly recommend them. They actually come in little glass jars, so they're super adorable. The tiramisu is good, it's not my favorite, but then again, my favorite is from an Italian restaurant that has an amazing chef, so I it really can't compare, but the glass jars are adorable. Moving along, we have the non bread that we got for the gyros that we will be having. That's actually on the menu for tonight. And here is the gyro meat. It is beef and lamb. It's not too bad, actually, for our packaged meat. The Hebrew National Hot Dogs, pomegranate seeds. Kids really liked these, all except one. One of the kids said it tasted a bit like alcohol, so. I'm not sure. Different taste buds though, right? This is the baked lemon ricotta cheese and it is delicious. I will be making a charcuterie board and I will be placing that on there. And then we have some blueberries, raspberries. Those are both from Costco. And then the blackberries came from Trader Joe's as well as that lemon ricotta cheese and the tomatoes. I got these tomatoes here. I thought that they would be really good. We like to make homemade pizzas. I thought that would be really yummy. So we also got some basil. We like to do fresh mozzarella, basil, and tomatoes for our pizzas. And here are the potatoes. They survived. They made it home. All is well. Then we have some lemons, limes, and apples. Here is the organic white bread. It is actually from Trader Joe's at only $2.99 a loaf, which is pretty reasonable for organic bread. The hot dog buns are $1.99. I picked up this mustard. We've never tried it before, but it's from Costco and I was there. There's some raspberry jelly. The kids chose raspberry this time. I'm excited to try this salsa from Costco as well. This peanut butter I picked up at Trader Joe's. 
Normally we will get a large container from Sam's, but this time I wanted to just pick up a small, small container. Then we have these pickles. Ethan wanted those. It was his request. So and they've got little pearl onions in there. So I'm guessing it's going to be pretty tasty. Now I have to say I've got two big bags, white sugar and brown, and they're both organic. I was a little put off by the price until I realized that they were both organic, which is different than Sam's. And we got some sparkling Welch's juice. That's going to be for our Hanukkah celebrations. We've got some wine, the pretty bottle, and another pretty bottle of wine. Honestly, that's why I picked them. I know nothing about these, so we'll see how it is in our roast. I finally picked up some smoked paprika, adorable container. This is my favorite hand soap so far. Um, it's the Trader Joe's. Then we got some strawberry yogurt O's. And here we picked up some Spanish saffron from Costco. This was on clearance, I believe, or at a closeout price, so I grabbed that. I tried this at my daughter's cleaning job, and I kind of like it to clean out the sink, so I grabbed a box of those, and then the trash bags. Then I picked up the Finish Quantum dishwasher tabs and some Finish Jet Dry. Guys, check it out, olive wood, olive shoots and ginger roots, and I seen this olive wood serving and cutting board, and I had to have it, so I grabbed that. Then we have some Scott toilet paper, which is the only brand we use. Next up is Quirk at $92.18. I got both sets of vacuum cleaner bags and e-cloth for washing dishes, general all-purpose cloth, which is similar to a Norwex cloth, plus this enzyme odor spot dissolver. I bought that to actually clean and sanitize the vacuum cleaner itself. Next is Sam's Club at $226.28. First up, we have Crunchmaster Multigrain Five Seed Crackers. Kids like those for lunches. And then my husband loves these small individual bags of chips, so I got him those. These tortilla chips, they come in two very large bags and they're great for nachos. The on the border chips for when we have taco soup and as always, the gluten-free crispy sea salt baked crackers. Then I got a box of pears. Two bags of avocados to which Olivia has made her amazing guacamole. More blackberries. Benjamin loves blackberries. Then I have some baby Swiss cheese, Colby and Monterey Jack, sharp cheddar, quite the variety this time. Daisy sour cream, our favorite way to buy Daisy in the three pound tubs. I did get butter this time. Hershey's chocolate syrup, I have a great Ina Garden recipe. I'll be using that for rosemary leaves and we've decided to try some bang bang seasoning and the Hellman's honey roasted turkey breast oven roasted turkey breast and then some turkey bacon and two bags of chocolate chips Up next is Target, $206.55. This week we set the boys up with new beds, new bedding, and I wanted to get them new pillows. So I went with these from Casa Luna at Target, and I have them on my own bed. I love them, I think that they're great, and the boys have used them now, and they do love them as well. I got the plush pillows, just the cheap $4 ones for the pillow shams. Did purchase mattress pad protectors as well as pillow protectors. These are the vitamins we use. We've been trying the organic milk, but I think we're going to stick with Fair Life. Pumpkin Spice Instant Oatmeal from Target. That's been a favorite. The strawberry banana we are trying. I bought some Carb Balance flour tortilla shells. It's supposed to be keto friendly and we are having enchiladas, so I thought I'd give it a whirl. Then I went slightly overboard with the orange juice here. One, two, three, four, five, although at one a day, that's not too bad. Crisco, I will be making some pies, rubbed sage, whole carrots, as well as some baby carrots. Some Hershey's chocolate bars for a recipe, which reminds me I should probably check the pantry to make sure that those have not 
Then we have some cilantro. And these Simply Potatoes ended up being a better deal from Target than at Sam's, so I got them at Target this time. And our favorite salad, which is the Classic Caesar from the Good & Gather brand. It is so good and so quick and easy. Moving right along, Natural Grocers, $336.40. I decided to give this multi-collagen protein a try. I have not tasted it yet, so I cannot report back, but I will update you with my thoughts. Just some more vitamins, a men's multi, prenatal, no, I'm not pregnant. <laughs> Vitamin D3, K2, more Smarty Pants. I picked up one there just in case they were out at Target. More prenatal formula. I have been experimenting with melatonin. I'll give you my feedback and my thoughts. I definitely don't believe in over medicating or medicating at all in general. And so, yeah, we'll see. But this right here is my favorite cleaner. It is worth every penny. Also, I forgot to mention, there's a few different types of deodorant there down in front and the Annie's mac and cheese. Here I have some rescue remedy for myself really helps calm nerves and anxiety if you ever have issues with that. I bought this little brush for a little Henry and I cannot tell you how soft these bristles are. So cute and it's so soft on their hair. And I got him this little sponge. It's a facial cleaning sponge but actually it works really good for little baby baths. Getting closer to the end, Hobby Lobby, $136.77. This was an unplanned stop, but I did find so many cute things that I think we're really gonna love and find use for. This cupcake stand is great. I've been without a large pan for a long time. I think it'll be great. And finally, Walmart, $424.26. Here we have some clothing items. Some of these items my daughter actually purchased and will be paying me back for. So some of these are hers, but that cute little outfit is Henry's. Here we have my daughter's purse and wallet that she purchased, as well as two pairs of sunglasses. We are missing one, but the kids picked those out when we went to go see Top Gun Maverick. Such a great movie. The only necessity item here would be the mouthwash. All right, guys, that brings us to our grand total of $2,163.65. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate all of the love and support. See you soon.